What's up, guys? It's Tommy Mars here, back with a special Christmas edition of a more set episode. Huh? So, ooh, that's nice and cold today. All right. So, a couple days ago, I dropped the episode where Maury was doing Against All Odds. Oh, man, that was so good. That was so good. You can watch that right here. I'll put it up there. And in that episode, I asked you guys and said, if you can give me some good recommendations or a link to a video where she's singing a like Christmas song or holiday carol or something like that, I'll get a special video out for you before Christmas. Well, here we are. You guys responded in a big way. You guys were tweeting me. You were DMing me on Instagram, leaving it in the comments of the last video. It's pretty awesome. And here we are today. And that video that I got recommended more than any other song was Oh Holy Night. And it was her at Star Mall. So I decided to pull this up. Take a listen, take a watch with all of you right before Christmas. So this is our Christmas treat. This is our Christmas bonus episode of Maury. Let's get right into it. Ooh, I like that blue dress. Looks good. Ooh, that's way down there. And she she's doing it. She's doing it. That is a low register and she, oh, she still does those runs. Pretty impressive. Okay, a couple things from that. First, I reason why I think this performance is actually so impressive is because the, almost the whole first half of the song, she was in a lower register that is not her, um, the sweet spot. I talk about the sweet spot, right? The sweet spot came 
about halfway through, it looks like there was like a cut or a, a meld or something in the video, and it went to another verse. That's a sweet spot. That's where she pushes. That's where she has all of us eating out of her hands. Well, actually, we all ate out of her hands when she went to that whistle voice. Woo, woo, woo. You could hear the crowd, too. I mean, it's pretty amazing. But back to the original thought was the first half of the song, she was in a lower register, which is not her sweet spot. She was able to not just sing the song well. She was also able to do runs and make a lot of movements. And that's very impressive because most singers me included, we're going to stay wherever is the most comfortable for us and the most where we can push and, and really get those notes out. Sometimes we wind up belting it out, right? With her, she was in these low notes that I'm like, I, I mean, I'm a, I'm a male singer. I don't even know that I could sing in those low notes. And on top of that, make those kind of movements. So I'll be honest, I thought that was really impressive for her to stay there, but then still do it, still command the range that she was in. So I personally, I think that was really impressive. Then when she gets into her sweet spot, you can hear her pushing. And then she said, she holds those notes out and the vibrato gets so much control, so much force. It is amazing. And then, then it's almost, I feel like everybody knew it was coming except me. I didn't even know it was coming, but boy, oh boy, when she went up there and hit that, I think the other thing about it is like Mariah Carey, you know, if you listen to her first record, especially mostly on studio recordings, she can get that whistle voice very, very well. But doing it live is a whole different thing. Now, early on in Mariah's career, she could hit it at will. But when she got older, it's harder to get that voice. And and some of that comes just from it comes from age. But the other thing that it comes from is overusing your instrument, maybe overdoing it, you know, playing too much playing too many shows, going up to that register too many times. With Maury, she's been doing it a long time, and man, she just goes to it at will. She just goes to it every time she wants to. And then the other thing is, when she gets there, do you see the movements that she makes? It's not just there. She's making those runs while she's up in that, that whistle voice. Gosh, she is something special, isn't she? She is just something special. Okay, this is supposed to be a short bonus episode, Christmas episode of Maury, and that's where I'm going to leave it. Thank you so much for everybody that recommended this one, that dropped me the link, that tweeted me, that DM'd me on Instagram. I appreciate you guys, man. This was definitely worth the watch. I will be back very soon with another Maury episode, of course. I'm not going anywhere, man. I, I am not going anywhere. If you want to get at me on my socials, like many of you have, T-O-M-M-Y-M-A-R-Z, B-A-N-D, Tommy Mars Band. That's where to find me. You can come let me know any Maury stuff that you want to see because I want to see it all. All of it. I want to see it all. I also want to wish you and your family a healthy, safe, happy holiday, Merry Christmas, whatever that you celebrate. I hope it's a good one. It's Tommy Mars. I will see you in the next video. Stay safe.